Welcome to my universe, to the massive truth, wherever you're watching me from around the world. I pray may the good Lord bless and strengthen you. May open that beautiful and gorgeous side of yours to make you see and understand from my own point of view. If you just see my video for the first time, you're very much welcome to my universe. Thanks for stopping by. Please do me a favor before you leave. Subscribe to watch more of my video. Hit the bell button to get notification whenever I have positive opinion and hot topic to share with my brothers and sisters. To so my gallant subscribers that keep coming back to check me out to see what I got to offer. Thank you very much. Thank you for coming back. Thank you for checking me out. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate you from the bottom of my heart. I appreciate your positive energy. I appreciate your correction. I appreciate your maturity. With that being said, I want to talk about the saga we did between Nigerians and Ghanaians right now. For, Ga for Ghana, some Ghanaians say they don't want Nigerians again. According to the report when I see for, for Joy News TV, the, the sharing for there say some Nigerians they kidnap their girls, say some Nigerians they take their business, say some Nigerians they break their law. Maybe you don't see it for social media too, where some Ghanaians begin to take law into their hand with all due respect to my Ghanaian brothers and sisters, with respect to my Nigerians. So before I give my little opinion, my brothers and sisters, I would like to share the report with Una so that make Una see from my point of view, so that Una understand where from the come when I they give my opinion, so that Una don't misjudge me. I don't say don't judge. Judge it makes you human. Please do bear with me. Let me hear the video. I will be back issue of concern when it comes to the increasing and changing crime patterns is the involvement of foreigners. At least three Nigerians were among the suspects in the Kumasi kidnapping incident with the information minister indicating that the ringleader is actually a Nigerian. There is a growing fear recent cases of kidnapping if not checked could have serious security implications for Ghana. What is even more worrying is the involvement of foreign nationals. Many including President Ikufuado, have publicly expressed concern about the situation. We are all concerned about this phenomenon of kidnappings, which we have not known. Our brothers and sisters in Nigeria have known it, but we have not known it in this country. And uh, we need to do something about it to make sure that it doesn't become a feature of our, uh, of our society. Um, I am very, very, very determined on the issue and decisions are being taken as we speak that will be a clear manifestation of the determination I have to deal with this matter. Police later confirmed the three suspects were Nigerians. On Wednesday, 29-year-old Nigerian John Oji appeared before a court in the Western region for the offense of conspiracy to kidnap and kidnapping. John is alleged to have taken part in the kidnapping of the three Takrade girls. Another Nigerian, Samuel Udutek Wills, has also been named as a suspect in the matter of two Canadians also involves three foreigners. Yes, Information Minister Koju Oponkroma providing details. At the end of the operation, the two Nigerians who were holding the women had been subdued and a third Nigerian believed to be the leader of the gang was arrested later at a separate location. At the end, and currently, five Ghanaians and three Nigerians are in custody for this incident. We're putting our nose together. It started recently. We saw that some foreigners were behind the first two okay. that we recorded, or three. Nigerians, including, including you mean? I would not like, you know, to preach hate crime or so. Not, not necessary. But it's a fact that they were Nigerians, mm. right? And looking at the trend, we are looking at it in more critical terms, you know, trying to do our analysis and be able to protect the Ghanaian and whosoever lives in our dear country. Ah! Right, my brothers and sisters, you welcome back to my universe. Thank you for sharing this beautiful time with me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Hope you see the video. Hope you listen to the report. Hope you see the way where some of my Nigerians did this poor their brothers way. Whether they spoil their brothers and sisters opportunity. Make we are beg, I beg in the name of God, my brothers. Make we try to the most try to the leave some bad things for our border. I beg in the name of God. I beg in the name of whatever you believe. This one will not be government matter again. This one 
our own personal problem where we get the it be like it be like say this bad attitude it be like say this bad this bad character we inherit it be like say inheritance i beg one of my brothers the way thing we they do so we they use until they spoil other people way i beg you in the name of god i beg you in the name of whatever you believe na na many people they talk say some ghanians they are racist some ghanians they don't want uh, uh, nigerians for their they don't want nigerians for their country more tell ourselves the truth my brother let's be plain now all the truth na go to save me and you all the truth na go make us the see facts all the truth na go save that our country nigeria if this thing when our brothers they do for another person country if these things what our sisters they do for another person country if they do one for our own country we not go accept them now nah. you shall say we will accept them brother you shall say we will accept them sister all these things what my brother what my brothers they do so is is really absolutely bad just imagine this girl you just imagine this girl now they are missing for for years the parents never see them the parents they cry so when this kind of thing they happen often you know go blame people when they take law into their hand you know go blame them for crying out loud i know they by any chance they talk so with the ghanians they do to take law into their hand say now better thing no no be better thing but it get weird person they reach you fed up you will tire say i wait see now let these people do for this world open any channel open any social media open any platform you must hear nigeria do something you must hear nigeria person commit atrocity with respect to each and every one of us with respect to you my brother with respect to you my sister make we start to the talk true and that they use this opportunity to beg my brothers and sisters where they sweet and loving where be law abiding citizen where they follow the law of any country where we day i beg you speak out i beg you in the name of god because your goodness your simplicity your your niceness one person feel you can destroy him because of the the bad thing we need do and at that one night they go take generalize all nigerians say our nigerians now so they be and now one person i do you they say no concern you now nigerians now know some of them not good and you they talk them for inside your room you know they talk them out you know they you know they create awareness to the good to to the good side of us people not feel no people not feel no my brothers and sisters i beg you to please come out make people where they advocate for good things i beg una make una come out for social media make una show the best side of nigerians i beg una in the name of god i beg una in the name of whatever you believe only one bad believe me you once they start to the share and now you will see say it will spoil your reputation it will spoil my reputation it will spoil your picking reputation it will spoil your neighbor reputation this is the reason why all of us need to stand for waiting really believe this is the reason why all of us need to stand for change what we want why you will come up for your house go kidnap somebody for another person house it just be like you come my house you want come kill me for my house why you will come up for your house go another person house just go destroy them you will see my brothers and sisters they they riot they do protest say they know they are right you know you're right now you come up for your country May we sit down, make we reason with all due respect to each and every one of us. This right will they claim for another person country. If we claim for our country, all these wicked politicians will make us exile in the first place. Go leave position, go come out for there. For real, my brothers and sisters, they go come out. All these muzzle will they show for another person country. We run come out for house, we not show the muzzle there. Many of us, with all due respect, are just coward. We we'll just come outside, come they show our muzzle, come they say, You don't know me or you don't know me. Go your country, may they know you for your country. Do that borrow for your country fight your politician tell them they give you good good security tell them they give you good job for real my brothers and sisters ghana and nigeria neighbor we be like cousins from nigeria to ghana is just one hour in a backyard so why we go to fight ourselves why we let politicians they poison our mind why we let politicians they make they they use us they do their policy their politics why my brothers why my sisters i know many ghanians i know many ghanians Ghanaians women know are loving and sweet caring people for real you want women don't come across so i i don't meet them Ghanaians are one of the nicest and sweetest african people where you feel meet for the surface of this planet for the history of africa 
the ones when we don't meet, the ones when we know, the Africans when we don't rapport with, when we don't mingle with. Ghanaian can, Ghanaian can just take their salary, they could just only take their ass rent inside, give you the rest, make you just say okay. When you are happy, Ghanaians are okay. The ones when we know. I know they by any chance they talk, say they are not bad ones too. You know, get we a bad person all day. As long this planet is consigned, any planet, any continent for this plan for the surface of this earth, there is bad person. You not get one country where you will go where you know will meet bad person, but the ones where we don't meet are the most sweetest and nicest people you can ever think of. But politicians they make they turn many of them to be bad. Politicians they turn their citizens to be beasts, to be evil, to to hate their neighbor, to hate their brothers and sisters. Ghanaians and Nigerians, we are just like brothers and sisters. We too they close. What we will let politicians come they like use us like this so my Ghanaians I beg Una, please help us speak out many many people they speak out many people they condemn this art many people they see and say this is political for real my brothers and sisters and my Nigerians please please I beg you many of us they sweet and loving you were they sweet and loving not talk say no concern you know affect you what you can concern me uh, uh, Nigeria saga Nigeria people matter I know we talk put my brother talk put with wisdom my sister talk put with wisdom talk in a way where you know safe person talk to you you go chop the word i beg you not be by the come social media come to do bag 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 now people go to understand your points sometimes you go they make points but the way you take react puts your body language go come you go just go just make everything where you they talk fly out the window i beg you my nigerians stand for the change where we truly want i beg you more tell all these politicians may they know they use us against ourselves look around look all the africa continents any saga where they go on now politicians, now they politi what are politicalized that they call them? Now they politicalize everything, then they turn everything to politics. That one are true. You go see African man, they tell African man may get out for a country. You go see African woman will tell African woman say you are a racist. Like seriously, one will be the same. We they do this one to ourselves. What do we say make uh, the white people in quotes do to us? What you say me they do, my brothers and sisters? I beg, it's high time we all stand together to say enough is enough. It's high time we all purge all this hate out. It's high time we all form African Union for re African Union, just as a uh, European Union did. So Africa too big way, be say we not get union. We they fight ourselves like this. How we say me union today? How we say may union today? I know that by any chance they justify any bad thing when Nigerians they do for another man country. No, I know that by any chance they justify them. What thing that they try and want to talk? No, no, they take law into our hands. You be Nigerian, you be Ghana, you be Senegal, you be Cameroon, you be as far as you don't come from Africa, don't take law into your hand. I beg you, be the change you want because of the future leaders of tomorrow, because of the seed where you they bring on life tomorrow. I beg you. What is some Nigerians really? they do sometimes you go see and you are a nigerian you go you remember me you all decan for his side for real when you see what is some nigerians they do you just want to like say oh are you really sure say your papa and your mama are from nigeria you go just really they fed up you'll be pissed may i leave you now with one video make you see what in nigeria do to one senegal guy now in one city thief person bicycle now he be one to kill the boy because of his own property make i share the video with you now hope you they see the video my brother hope you they see the video my sister this one a nigeria boy will be one kiss any guy guy because of his own property because of his own bicycle now the guy don't the jd this video not be saying yesterday video not be day before yesterday video but i just want to make example for you to see say some things what our nigeria brothers and sisters they do they they disgusting they they irritating that is why you need to stand for change that is why you need to let your voice out that is why you need to let the population of the good people many pass the bad people when you sit down comfortable for your house believe me you the seed way they bring corn life now this kind jaga jaga word that they want con day you don't speak for yourself now you speak for the seed where you they bring on this life because all these people that they really they damage the good name where me are you they try build i beg you to speak out i beg you to condemn what's not good i beg you not to take law into your hands again 
seeing this boy now is irritating and disgusting. If Mami be the citizen of Italy, this thing happen for Italy. Uh, do you think I'll be happy with Nigeria? You want to kill your own brother. You want to kill your own black brother, according to as we say they talk and say they racist. Who we'll just see this one and see the guy where he did it, see the Oibo where he did it, with respect to all Italians. If you say this guy not fear, you do this kind of thing to your own brother. Who me come be where you not go just chuck for neck? Who me just be where you not go just strangle me? Like, make we are beg, make we speak out, make we let the good people, many pass the bad people for social media. And make we are beg, more not the share saga video, more not the share video of hate. I beg you in the name of God. I beg you in the name of whatever you believe. Please, my brothers and sisters, you get one Ghana man where he come at, come talk, say, in support this violence because it, uh, uh, some Nigerians, they follow and they drag a customer in the do, in the, in the set uh, motto pass, I think. As a result of the above, we, the Aboso Kinds Pepper Dealers Association, we want to, one, affirm our support to our brothers and sisters in Kumachi who have taken it upon themselves to defend the cause of freedom and enforce the right in their business. We want also to register our displeasure towards that shameful speech by the so-called Nigerian professor, which has gone viral on social media. We also want to register our displeasure to the Nigerian High Commissioner for attacking our media for doing their rightful job. Inform government to act within a matter of two weeks or the Aboso Kinds Pepper Dealers Association will take a destiny into our own hands to register our displeasure with a dormant approach taken by government toward this canker in our society. In combat, he endorses these things where, where all these people they do. He endorses all these things where they, they do to their own fellow Africans, which is really bad. Violence is for nobody because at the end of the day, now our children will come suffer this thing. When we start to they hate and beef ourselves like this, how we say make change they come? How we say make love they day for this world? I love nature so much. That is why I so much believe on nature. As me being, if you ask me, say, what thing I deserve, who I believe on, I'll tell you, I believe on nature. Because nature is there everywhere. I feel feel them. I feel see them. I feel see them. I believe so much on nature. Nature has a way of doing things. It they make us the bond for ourselves. Ghanaians they marry Nigerians. Nigerians they marry Ghana. So how one can do our children? How one can do the innocent children? What we bring come life? You know if we cut that picking into two, you say Ghana take one, Nigeria take one. It's not possible. Nature will try to bring us together to make us understand. Say we are one. We are the same. Make we stop this hate no matter the color we'll get for our skin as far as a love day we will make our blood miss to bring us together to make us understand say there is nothing greater than love if we start to hate ourselves now if we start to fight ourselves as politicians one more they fight ourselves now how one do our children how one do the children all born for each other? Many Ghanaians born for Nigerians. Many Nigerians born for Ghanaians. Would they make these things they had for couples, for people who love themselves? Because they're not going to know who they want to join. If you marry Nigeria, Nigeria not will fit join a uh, Nigeria people. Ghana, Ghana not fit join Ghana people. So now put them for very difficult situation. Before we take any decision, make we are beg, make we see say nature need love. Nature don't bring many people together. Picking all day for 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 each other family you not get one country for this life where be say we never miss within ourselves you not get and you know you not get one citizen where, where nigerian person not get picking for any country you can think of in this world you not get the one way way nigeria not get picking for we get picking for every citizen every country where we go we must leave one seat there seed what for seed what they live for there now seed of protection now symbol of love now it's, that's why kinship that time to secure their friendship to secure their bond to secure their trust they go they go exchange their picking this king will bring a picking the other king will bring a picking con, they go marry them to take seal their bond, to take trust themselves. Then that their children will come born. That their children will come born. They are, that their trust, that their that their friendship will come tight to away. Nature say and say, okay, now so this my children will take it take on together. It begin they miss us together. She begin make us they fall in love with different ethnic, different di different culture, different 
different citizens. We begin to miss ourselves. So make we are beg. Make we follow the footstep of nature. Make we stop to the hold on to these hates. I beg you in the name of God. I beg you in the name of whatever you believe. Because history they repeat itself. History is repeating itself. All of us refuse to learn from history. All of us refuse to read history. All of us refuse to listen to what if it happen. Learn from other people's mistake. This one, well, of us they talk say, eh, hey, they can deport. They can deport. They told they deport Nigerians. They told they deport Africans. They raise this. Do you know say Nigerians still they deport? Do you know say Nigerians still they deport? Go 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 Wikipedia. Wikipedia. <laughs> I don't know. You know now. <laughs> go Wikipedia. Right now. Say what thing happened when Nigeria deports Ghanaians that time? Now because of politics. When pol when politics don't they reach ground? When they want to do politics, they go look for one thing to take put hate for your mind say now nah, nah, foreigners now nah, cause with their economy collapse now nah, cause with their economy not the boom none of them they take responsibility of of their wrongdoing no one they tell us say they still low that they always they find somebody for you to focus on that they always they find somebody to put the blame on that they always they find reason to make you hate your own brother so make you hate your own sister for wikipedia my brothers and sisters your right and ghana must go he did there in 1983 when Shehu Shagari was the president of Nigeria, an executive order was given to immigrants without proper immigration documents to leave the country or they would be arrested according to the law. Most of the immigrants were West African and mainly Ghanaians. Over 2 million men, women and children were affected. 2 million, my brother, over 2 million were affected. Children. And we are complaining. So, hey, Jemio, they deport Mama and Peking because it's social media not did that time. No, me say we not do the same thing. History, they repeat itself because me and you just refuse to say a no. Me and you just refuse to just let love reign. Me and you just begin to believe on the lie where politicians they feed us with. For real, that is why they no one more go to school for Africa because when we go to school, we will see all these facts. It is documented. It, they document everything. They put them for years so that make me and you not make the same mistake we don't fed it for past. But what does politicians do today? They go back to the old book and pick the, the word of hate inside, they weaponize all those words, bring and come public for me and you to hate ourselves, for me and you to see our neighbor and call the oh now nah, them. Oh, these people now nah, they now nah, cause I will not get business. These people now nah, cause I will not get money. These people they rob from our economy. These people they carry our money, go their country. Will not be waiting they happen today. Not be waiting they happen today because we refuse to learn from the mistake our forefathers has made before. So as I was saying before, I was rudely interrupted by me. Over 2 million men, women, and children were affected. This thing what they talk so. Now, Ga now Ga Ghanaians never start this thing with respect to my Ghana brothers and sisters. Incidentally, okay, now this one I want me to say. Incidentally, in 1969, Ghanaians also expelled Nigerians from its country. Ghana in enacted the Aliens Compliance Order in which hundreds of thousands of immigrants, most of which were Nigerians, were falsely expelled from the country. So you you see this, you see these things in a political something. The politicians, they use us against ourselves. It's high time, my generation, you, 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 my brother, you, my sister, no matter where you come from Africa, it's high time all of us tell them, say, enough is enough. It's high time we tell them, say, may they stop to they use our brothers and sisters till they make their evil law. More we stop to the tendency, may they take off us, may they know they turn us against ourselves. Look South Africa. South Africa hates their own brothers, hates their own sisters. Why? Because the politicians make them understand, say, now nah, their own brothers and sisters, their own fellow human beings, where they suffer like them, where they struggle like them, now nah, they be their enemy. Politicians make them believe like that. See America, not the same thing they happen for America. What did Donald Trump they tell Americans? They tell them, say, now nah, the immigrants were there for, were there for America, now nah, they rob their job. Now they collect their job. Now make the citizens not get job, and which is not true. Immigrants where they work, they contribute to your economy. Immigrants where they work for your country, they boosting the economy. But they go back to the to the old book. They go back to the politics book to go bring something. We go make you hate your own neighbor. We go make you say, oh, not true. Do you not see that a uh, uh, Cameroon person? See, I store the boom. Oh, me will be Nigeria. Oh, see, my Nigeria people know they patronize me. 
They don't they patronize you because you know they say better thing. That one are the truth, my brothers and sisters. When politicians can't come, can't tap in our anger, we could just explode. And we know they, we know they see and say, now with the same thing way we Africans, they do towards ourselves. Now other countries, they do. You'll be black, you'll be green, you'll be purple, as long as they be politicians, they go back to old book to repeat history, to repeat what if they happen. As long as we refuse to let go hate, as long as we embrace hate, they will continue to they use the old book. They will continue to they show you, say now your neighbor, say now your brother and your sister where they struggle because they be alien, because they be immigrants, now they be your enemy. They never for once talk on one day, talk say now so they embezzle money. Money where Abacha steal from Nigeria, since 90 with respect to our bachelor family, money where they went in damn time. Do you know they are still retrieving it today? Since today, they see they retrieve them. But nobody, no politician, no politician will tell any Nigerian say Abacha was the enemy of Nigeria. Say he robbed he robbed us, he robbed us from our sweat. But who did they point to? They will point to Ghanaians. Ghanaians go point to Nigerians. Nigerians go point to Senegal. Senegal go point to uh, Avorian. Avorian we go just they, they go they point, they go they carry our eyes they go different place you go they see and say now white don't say no 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 come on your eye for there no be white look here look here here now green lights there here and of which now there be the problem they will never let you know so please my main message now make we the new generation say enough is enough make we stop this hate by ourselves make we let people be make we know they say oh this one marry Ghana who will just leave all Nigeria go marry Ghana that is hate speech I beg you my brothers and sisters we should let love reign. I beg you. Now politicians now be our enemy. Now politicians they use all these my Ghana, all these my Ghana brothers. They they fight their own neighbor. They they fight their own brother because election does they come. Because they need something to feed them with. Because they don't want to take blame. They don't want to tell them say now them be the criminal. We make them they suffer. They they point to Nigerians. Say oh Nigeria now they now Nigerians now they rob una now they rob una una things. Now Nigeria no make una get a. Uh, good job now nigerians then they rob on our business and which is not true don't get me wrong you know it, i know they try to talk say some nigerians don't they constitute nuisance some nigerians they constitute nuisance all over the world on any channel you must see one channel you must see one social media platform where you will foresee one nigerian they constitute nuisance now so it be for all over the world on all, all country get one person where they constitute nuisance just that you they see her because you get many friends will be nigerians you get many friends where be Nigerians. You na Nigeria. You get 200 friends. Out of that 200 friends, must see something where not good way Nigeria person do. He go share and he go come to your war. That one not me say America person no they do saga as Nigeria person they do saga. That one not me say Italian person no they do saga as a uh, 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 Ghana people they do saga. That one not me say uh, German citizen no they do saga as a uh, uh, Ivory Coast people they do saga. He they everywhere. You not go see him because you not be those people friend. Once you don't be those people friend, one of those people must share that saga come your platform. If you want to know, when you never, when you never get car, you know will ever notice say that car many for streets. Once you don't buy that product, before you come off of your streets, you must see two or three people where you get that pattern. You can say, ah, now so this is my motto just men. If it many, just that you don't get that product, then make you not say many. So now so you just be. When you begin to see one particular country, they do, they do retaining thing now because you get many of those people for your friend list now then they always they send you saga video now then they always they want to remind you so oh we get this kind of people for our family so i beg you my brothers and sisters be the change you want you will you not know, say waiting some nigerians they do they retate you please wear your jesus shirt enter social media talk politely make people know say oh see they are still sweet and loving people from that country i hope you understand i hope you see reasons for me i hope we stand for the change we want i hope we all tell these politicians say we don't they see you cannot turn me against my own brother you cannot turn my sister against me when we tell them say make them bring another new logic because this old book is not working again our eye don't clear please go to google go to wikipedia for google you will see and just write some say the reason nigeria government dry uh, 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 spell uh, Ghanaians in 80s write and say why a uh, reason why Ghana 
Tanzanians expel uh, 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 Nigerians in 60s. You will see uh, they, they honor politics, honor politics. They just need to provoke you. They just need you to hate your neighbor. Please let all of us stop all these evil politicians. Let all of us let them know, say, we know so that I'm be the bad person. Don't give us reason to hate. We want reason to love. No, we tell them, say, may they, they point their self where they rob from us. May they, they bring the money where they rob come at. May they not they point finger to our neighbor where you see the struggle as we take the struggle. I hope you understand. I hope you see reasons for me. I hope you not take this my video personal because I just look for a way to stand and represent the change when I truly want. Go history. Anything you don't understand, write and fat for Google. You will see and say, go give you the facts. So work with facts. Let's fight these politicians. You will see, say, change what they look for for decades. It will come. Don't we just stretch away this hate through window. See, I come your way next time. This of you universe, the massive truth. Please subscribe if you've not subscribed. Hit the bell button to get notification whenever I have positive opinion and hot topic to share with my brothers and sisters. Don't forget to give my video thumbs up. See, I come your way next time. Love you in the name of love. Love you in the name of whatever you believe. See, in the next video, one love. Mm.